Hi guys. This case s about AD713 derivative project case study solution. Profile of client. The client is Thrifty Saber, who is 55 years of age and a successful entrepreneur business owner. During the span of his career, he amassed a large sum in savings totaling $5 million, which he has divided into two separate accounts, $2.5 million in a retirement account, 80% in equity and 20% in fixed income, and $2.5 million in a non-retirement account. His wife, Prudence Saver is 52 years old and has been a housewife slash stay-at-home mother, primarily. Together they share two children, Jack and Jill, who recently graduated from their respective universities and landed jobs with potential growth opportunity for advancement with retirement benefits, choosing instead not to participate within the family's business thus, Thrifty and Prudence no longer need to support their children. Thrifty's income is approximately $400,000 annually, of which he contributes $20,000 each year to the equity portion of his retirement account. Goals and Objectives of the Client As aforementioned, Thrifty has accumulated a substantial amount of savings after many years of working, and will enter into retirement after five time. Thus, his main objective is to achieve high growth potential of his current assets portfolio to prepare for the impending retirement stage of his life. The overall outcome he desires upon retirement is to continue maintaining his hard-earned quality of life, carefree lifestyle, and financial freedom since he carries no significant financial obligations or need to support his children or grandchildren. Thrifty anxiously awaits our proposal. For these reasons, the main objectives for Thrifty should be strong capital growth over the next five years, then a stable source of income when he enters his retirement. Specifically, he would like to achieve at least 15% annual growth rate of his portfolio in the next five years, and then stable returns of 5 to 8% when he reaches the retirement age. Hi guys! This case is about leadership challenges in developing countries in light of the Global Strategy for Achieving Clean Energy Initiative Project Case Study Analysis.